let me just uh, allow me to, to mention another wonderful gentleman who lost his life at the incident, and that was a worker who worked at the store, not a member of the Jewish community, I think his name was Douglas. When we issued the press release, we didn't have the full details. May he rest in peace. Uh, he served everyone who came into that place fairly, and our heart goes out that he is also part of what we now call a list of dead people because of horrific criminal activity. So to your question was, why, sh why shouldn't they be feared? Is why should Jews be, why, what, what would you tell people about why Jews are not different than you and that why they should not be feared, which is what seems to be talking to me? I think our, the record we have been here for, for yeah, you know, since the since the our country was uh, created, we were here, and of course, over the past 60, 70 years, after the mayor so eloquently presented the Holocaust in its real light, because the real light is not only the six million and plus others who were killed, but what has led to that, and that is important, an important lesson. But I would say in the 60, 70 years we have, we have been here, we have established organizations, tar charitable institutions, and do you find a bad apple? Yes. But we have been living in harmony with our neighbors. Let me talk to you a second about Williamsburg. Williamsburg was the first of the first places where we accepted public housing when nobody wanted. And we accepted that, and we have been for 50 years living in harmony together. Come to Williamsburg. Don't believe what you hear. Come and see side by side, a, a Jewish community member, a Latino, an African American, the UJO itself has buildings that we, we have built. We will live together mixed, integrated. So, therefore, you should not be feared. F ask the people in Schaefer Bill in at Schaefer Landing, where we have, we were the sponsors. Uh, you have 141 units. 42 are Jewish. The rest is everybody in the, world, in the world, what we see in our mix. And we live together. To look at what happened. This person, one of the, the members of the community is hospitalized, and hopefully he'll go home soon. He was, he ran out, and who saved him? A, a community and, and a minority neighbor pulled him in into his house. This should, this should be glorified and to show us that we should stay together. And that's the answer. We are charitable. We are working with our neighbors. And as Deborah will tell you, I've been going out, uh, I've met with the principals. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. The, the, the district for the superintendent called together her whole cabinet, and we are going to go into the schools. Deborah was there. And Mr. Mayor, I can just tell you, Gav should give you the strength to continue to lead the city in a very safe and peaceful city. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.